this video we'll be acquiring stars for collected coins. To do this open our hero script and put here a private field int collected coins. And when our hero will collect coins then it has to be counted in so let's just add collected coins equal collected coins plus one. Now it's time to care about time to let know our game to finish level. Let's create a public field called time. Public float time equal 10. It will be 10 seconds. In order to finish level when the time is over, it must be progressively counted down. So write time minus equal time delta time. And when the time is over, if time less or equal zero, and all coins has been collected if collected coins equal equal free then we want our player to gain all three stars in order to do that you have to enable math level manager properties that are representing stars just add here using math level manager by default, all math level manager example scenes and prefabs are defined in three properties that are responsible for displaying stars. These are called star underscore one, star underscore two, and star underscore three. To enable a property, just write math level profile and then use set level boolean that takes level name as first parameter. To get current level name use mat level current level name and property named star underscore one. Finally set it to true. If the player has collected all three coins then every star property have to be also set to true. So copy and paste what we have for our star underscore one property and change its name to star underscore two and star underscore three. If we have two coins collected, else if collected coins equal equal two. Then enable only star underscore one and star underscore two property without setting star underscore three property to true. This way, player will only get two stars for this level. And else if collected coins equal equal one, then only one star should be given. At the end of any of these cases, we want level to be completed and also unlock next level. So use mat level profile set completed mat level current level name Finishing every level with score or even without should take us back to main menu. Math level. Load level by name and level select screen. We 
because this is how I'll name my menu in my level configuration. Let's use on GUI and a simple label just to see the time counting down to the end of our level. Void on GUI. And here GUI layout. Label. Time left. Plus time. After all of that, it's finally time to create our level configuration and add levels to play our fantastic game.